Let's take a look at the performance of midsize family SUVs in the updated moderate overlap crash test. The Insurance Institute for Highway Safety recently updated its long-standing crash test to add a rear passenger dummy. Rear passenger protection has been lagging behind in safety advancements, and the Institute is hoping to change that with this new test. Unfortunately, the results of the updated test are not great for most mid-size SUVs. Only two models scored good ratings in the tougher crash test. The remaining earned a rating of marginal or poor. In last place is the Jeep Grand Cherokee. The passenger dummy's head moved outside of the side curtain airbag. This is extremely dangerous because it puts the head at risk of impact with outside objects. The Hyundai Palisade also scored poorly. The rear seat passenger is at high risk for head and neck injuries in the Palisade. The Toyota Highlander did a little better, earning a marginal rating. The main problem in the Toyota is the rear passenger dummy seatbelt shifted from the pelvis onto the abdomen, which increases the risk of injuries. The Volkswagen Atlas also earned a marginal rating. The rear seat passenger is at moderate risk for head, neck, and chest injuries. Just like the Volkswagen, the Chevrolet Traverse earned a marginal rating and has a moderate risk of injuries for the passenger's head, neck, and chest. The second highest performer is the Subaru Ascent, which earns a good rating. In first place is the Ford Explorer. It slightly edges out the Subaru by having less structural intrusion. If you found this interesting, please subscribe to see more captivating videos about auto safety.